Well, look at Thursday to everyone out there. Lots of sunshine today. Temperatures climb from uh, mid-morning into the mid-40s. We'll see temperatures climbing into the 50s for the most part as we get into the afternoon. We're going to go with a high of 57 here in Columbus. Futurecast keeps us dry and mostly sunny. Those northwesterly winds evident as we go through the day. Uh, temperatures going to be topping out generally anywhere from about 49 to 54 in the Tupelo region. Once you get the Golden Triangle, more like anywhere from 53 over towards Grenada up to about 57 once you get towards Columbus and in Macon. West Alabama, anywhere from about 50 to, uh, 53 degrees in Hamilton up to about 58 degrees in Aliceville. Futurecast keeps us dry Friday and Saturday, but late Saturday night to Sunday, you see there comes our rain chance. Doesn't look like a, uh, a heavy soaking of rain, but some much needed rain uh, as we head into Sunday. So here's what the models are spitting out as far as total amounts of rainfall on Sunday. I want to point out this isn't a forecast, but what the forecast models tend to think could happen here. Anywhere from about uh, three-tenths of an inch from the European model up to about a half an inch from the, the uh, American and Canadian models there. So, uh, again, we could use a little bit more rain than that, but that is unfortunately looking like what most folks are going to end up getting. So, pretty good chance that everybody sees at least some rain on Sunday. Once we get past Sunday, forecast becoming much more unclear. The forecast models really splitting on as to what they think is going to happen. Uh, as for the forecast, we're going to sort of split the difference a little bit. We're going to go with the higher end of things as far as temperatures are concerned into the 60s. But we're going to keep a low end rain chance on the board. But again, that's something that we're going to have to watch pretty closely because we may have to bump those rain chance or completely remove them from the seven day forecast depending on how things work out over the next few days. Meteorologist Amanda Reynolds have an update on your forecast coming up tonight on WCBI News at 5.